A Chico man shot in cold blood, and tonight his family is trying to pick up the pieces, coping with the sudden loss of a loved one. Action News Now Morning anchor Julia Yarbo gives us a rare insight from a grieving woman whose partner was taken by violence. Surreal. That's how one woman describes the past two days. She's trying to come to terms with not only losing her partner to violence, but also wondering how this case will play out. Just feet from the home Raylene Kramer shared with her partner is the spot that will now be remembered is where violence snuffed out a future. What's going through your heart? Pain. Still not fully processing it. Sunday, July 26, Chico police say this man, Kai Pirelli, shot and killed 28-year-old Scott Thompson. He wasn't only a boyfriend, he was a son, he was an uncle, a brother, and a stepdad. He loved to fish. He took my kids in as if they were his own. Kramer says Thompson loved music, played the guitar. She describes him as a hard worker, committed to his friends and family. She says Thompson's shooting death happened just after he had loaded up the car to head out on a fishing trip. While the shots were going off, I stood up and looked, and I couldn't see where he was. And then I looked down and saw him in the road and ran across traffic, and he was taking his last breaths. Kramer says at this stage, she isn't quite sure what comes next for her, but she says one of the most difficult aspects of all of this is explaining Thompson's death to her children. Julia Yarbo, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Kramer says she has talked with investigators about what she heard and saw that day. Police arrested Pirelli a short time after the shooting. He is being held on $1 million bond at the Butte County Jail, charged with murder.